Good morning, everyone. It's Haley. Welcome to Mom Life Vermont, and welcome to a very special episode here on Mom Life Vermont. Today is my birthday, and every year on my birthday or close to my birthday, I always try and think about all the things that happened in the year and all the great things that I've accomplished or the great things that have come into my life in my last year. And then I also like to think about where my life is going, what my hopes are for the new year. I am currently 33 years old and it's a whole new decade and I'm 33 years old. It's really crazy to think that I'm heading into my mid thirties, but life's a change in very much so. You guys have not seen much of this on the channel. There is so much coming on the channel. Subscribe if you want to hear or see the whole journey about anything I talk about in this video today because you're going to get a lot of sneak peeks at things that are to come, such as this. I'm currently at the gym at 6.30 in the morning on my birthday because I want to be. I want to be here. I want to work out. I'm training for a half marathon right now. My goal is to run at Disney World in 2021. And I was thinking about it, that's something that I'm doing it when I'm 34. So while I'm 33, I'm gonna be working really hard to become more healthy and more fit than I've probably been in my entire life. So far, it's working very well. I've lost over 20 pounds. It is a journey. You guys will see the whole journey coming up on the channel, I promise. But let's get to working out. I'm at the gym. It's 6.30 in the morning. It's my birthday. I just had a really good, good, amazing workout. So you guys will get like a whole inside scoop of how I ended up at this gym, the nerves about coming to the gym, the excitement of coming to the gym, and some upcoming videos. But in this video, if you happen to be in Vermont or from Vermont or in the St. Albans area, definitely check out Dukes. They have really great deals. They're so family friendly. Like, they're so friendly. Like, the gym owner today wished me a happy birthday. Like, it's just, like, I bet I'm going to go to the doctors right now. To, I'm actually going to PT right now. Yay, birthdays. And I bet they won't know it's my birthday. And if they do, I'd be very surprised. I didn't even get a happy birthday from Kenny yet, but I blame that on night shift, not necessarily on the fact that he forgot, but we will see how today goes. I ran out of space on my phone, which is actually a very normal occurrence in my life right now. But anyway, uh, it's I'm just so far beyond where I would have been a year ago. There's a video of, I think, heading in. I think I was, it's, it's the last day of me being 31. So it was like this time last year. And I just don't think that I was, I like, I'd have to go back and watch it, but I just don't think I was in the mindset of, like, getting healthy. I made a bit, I might have been to a point, meaning, like, I was going to the doctors a little bit more regularly and figuring out things, but I definitely was not at the point where I was like, let's run a half marathon and then actually be putting that idea to action because I bet I had this idea or working out or getting healthy a lot but to actually be like going to the gym three times three to four times a week working out every day at home trying to get 11,000 steps you guys don't know all this yet but all of this is coming like all these things that I've thought about throughout this year and I've actually put them into action is just bonkers to me absolutely bonkers it's so amazing I'm super excited to see what 33 has in store for me because at least the end of 32 because I really started this weight loss adventure here in November so it's not like it was a whole lot of time that I was working on this it, it's very new but the fact that like I look at the next year and I'm like I'm gonna be almost a whole new person when I do this video next year and not a whole new person because I'll still be me I'll just look like half of me right we will see I mean my my goal on this journey is not necessarily to get skinny it's to get back to a weight that I'm normal happy with which is about 200 pounds right now and be able to run 13.1 miles that's the goal of this whole adventure so in my th year 32 so last year I made a plan that I was going to run a half marathon I got a lot of people involved and that marathon is set for my 34th year, so February of, t of 2021, I will be running a half marathon. So this year I have a lot to do. I have a lot to get ready for. I have a lot. But I have to get to PT. I gotta start this car, I gotta get going. 
So as I've been trying to think about things that have happened over the last year that I have wanted to say, like, these are really amazing things that happened last year that I'm going to carry into this new year and make sure that I am living my best life possible. And since the weight loss journey has been, I've been so involved with it and it's been such an important part of my life for the last four months, I'm having a hard time, like, thinking about other things. And then I realized that um, we bought a house, like, we bought a trailer so we have like we did like that happened like eight months ago so right now it's obviously covered in snow and is not in the best of like appearances maybe but we've worked really hard to hey Shiloh dogs running off we've worked really hard to get hey Shiloh dog is saved he's now back in the yard little turd ball so yeah we basically had the opportunity to buy this trailer that there's definitely videos coming up. I believe on Friday is going to be the first look slash renovation video that will be on the channel, but I probably just gave away the whole idea of the video, which is like, did we buy it? And guess what? We bought it. <laughs> so like, just, I think about when I look at those videos of the first time we looked at this place and the questioning and the contemplating of actually moving in and actually buying it and the changes that that would cause and the changes that hopefully would be good changes, like it was such a big decision that here we are eight months later and we're living in it and while we're still in the fits of renovations and the yard is still like covered in renovations, we are moving in a direction like we moved in a really good direction like i feel like there are so many positive changes that have happened in my life that like i say like oh the weight loss journey the weight loss journey the weight loss journey but in reality part of the reason i'm on in the weight loss on the weight loss journey is from changes that i really started to make at the beginning of last year and goals that i have set for myself and basically like what do I want and what are my expectations as I grow older because yeah I'm not super old I'm only 33 but I'm not 23 it's just like a different phase of your life so buying a house getting my health in order like there are just some really positive things that happened last year that I'm going to take into this new year and a whole new adventure like it's crazy but I just wanted to fill you in as I brought the dogs outside and I do actually have to work today now that I've made my got myself home from my doctor's appointments I am working welcome say hi hi <laughs> so I am currently making my birthday dinner I worked all day and as I was working today I was trying to think like is there anything work related that I'm super happy or proud of or that I accomplished this year? And I couldn't really think of anything, but the one thing I have realized over the course of this year is I am very lucky to have a job that I love, coworkers that I love, be a part of a team that I love, be paid well for what I do. That that just made me like feel like since I became grateful for that over the last year, that it was something to just mention. But even though I might not feel, is that cabbage not good? It's not. <laughs> then don't eat it. So, although I don't feel like I maybe necessarily like contributed large amounts or like produced, uh, like what am I thinking? Although I don't feel as though I like reached any particular goal or had any particular goal, I definitely worked really hard and I have lots of things that I did and I have lots of work that I can show for over the last year, but it just makes me feel very happy that I have become grateful for the job that I have. I'm very grateful for the job that I have and that's something that I realized over the last year, so yay! I'm gonna show you guys my dinner here. So, if you have not, well, you guys would not be following along, but upcoming here, I'm working with a couple wellness coaches, so on the channel, that whole journey will be here. And the wellness coach had often said, my nutritionist had often said, take what you have in your fridge, throw it into a pan, put some eggs on it, and you got a meal. So that's what I did today, because typically I really love to have a birthday omelet, and we don't have a working stove or oven, which is another adventure you're about to hear about on the channel, so hit the subscribe button. So I'm just going to show you my omelet, which is actually delicious. I'm surprising, surprisingly delicious. 
Here it is. I'm gonna make a couple potatoes and that is dinner. End of my birthday here. It's been an absolutely amazing day. And it's funny because I'm like, it's been an amazing day, but I literally went to the gym. I just like enjoyed my day. I didn't really have anything planned at this point. Kensley and I hung out for a while. Kenny's at work. I do have uh, like plans for tomorrow and Sunday, Saturday. So, so there's definitely like birthday adventures happening. But my dad and Linda came over. I went over to my mom's. Just, just enjoyed my birthday. So that's it was it was amazing. One of the things that I did do today was watch reflecting on 31 which was my birthday video from last year and one of the things that really stuck out to me about that video was one of the goals that i had for my 32nd year was to start making money on youtube and while i have i guess started to make money i haven't actually received any money there's like certain thresholds that you have to make reach and i just haven't made that reach them but i guess you could say i make like 30 cents a day on the channel or something ridiculous like that at this point so I guess I met the goal um, I'm striving to go beyond that and at this point I guess I have like a really clear understanding of what I hope the channel is going to be and become so it'll be interesting to see how 33 goes and what happens this year I'm just I always love like New Year's because it's the start of a new year and I always love my birthday because it's the start of a new year for me so we'll see how it goes I hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know how you I guess how your day went because it might not be your birthday and if it is your birthday then happy birthday to you I will see you guys next time and have a great day bye bye